Hello developers! Welcome back to Droid Scripter. In today's tutorial, we're going to make a simple app widget using Jetpack Compose. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe for more Android development content. Now, let's dive into the code. First, we need to add the specific glance dependency in your app's module based on the features you need. Next, Create a new class that extends from Glance App Widget and overrides the Providiglance method. This is the method where you can load data that is needed to render your widget. Within the Provide Content block, we're utilizing Compose to define our widget's UI. A column with a light gray background is created, and we've added a couple of button components for quick navigation to the main app and settings. Now, let's explore the Test Widget Receiver class. This class is responsible for initializing our simple widget and setting it as the Glance App Widget. Define the simple widget object in an XML resource file using a single app widget provider element, and save it in the project's Ray XML folder.
The default home screen positions widgets in its window based on a grid of cells that have a defined height and width. Most home screens only let widgets take on sizes that are integer multiples of the grid cells. For example, two cells horizontally by three cells vertically. Now register the provider of the app widget in your Android Manifest.xml file, in the associated metadata file, in our case, simplewidget.xml. Let's run our app and add the widget to the home screen. And there you have it, a quick guide to creating a custom glance app widget with Jetpack Compose. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to hit that like button. If you have any questions or suggestions for future videos, drop them in the comments below. Subscribe for more Android development content. And until next time, happy coding!